Um, I actually wanted to make my own pronouns for Korean, so I'll call Ian. Call Ian. Call Ian. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? You met him? I haven't. I had a cardboard cut out of him, which I actually married in Las Vegas. You are handsome. Johnson, yes, they are. Then I think BTS probably have a WhatsApp group where every time they see me talking about Jimin or getting married to his cardboard cut out, I think they're probably enjoying. Yeah, would they, would they be flattered? Yeah. Um, I'm sure Jimin would be very flattered. Maybe he'll smile, maybe he'll laugh. You know, I like to make people entertained and smile, but I'm sure he'd be very flattered. But I'm sure he'd be very flattered. Very flattered. What? What? You married a cardboard cutout. Yeah, I was in Vegas. I was like, you know, people do crazy things in Vegas and I couldn't have the real guy, so I was like, let me marry him. How was the wedding night with the cardboard cutout? Uh, you know, I did get a few paper cuts. It was a bit <laughs> uncomfortable, yeah. yeah. Ew! Ew! What the fuck? When did you realise you were different? Um, I think when I was a kid, I realised, like, I didn't fit in with other people. I didn't fit into society. I'd always watched um, kind of Japanese animations, learned about Chinese history, Korean history. My guy straight up said that he doesn't fit into society because he likes anime and learning about history. What the fuck? You want to have, very briefly, you want to have Korean babies? I do want to, I don't know whether I'm going to adopt or if I can genetically mm -hmm. modify one in the laboratory, but I do want only 100% Korean Gates, baby. Ask Bill Gates he can help you with the lab meat. Well, I don't think I'd want to do anything <laughs> with Bill Gates. <laughs> he'll, he'll grow you something Korean. Ali London in your area. <laughs> I'll light up the sky. I don't know your I'll kiss you goodbye.